What's good, everybody? It's DL saying, hey, I just wanted to jump on real quick to talk about the WNBA, NBA pay gap conversation is going on right now. I truly don't understand this. Like this, this thing where you have a group of people, women, up in arms and upset about business. I mean, it's just supply and demand. The WNBA does not generate enough funds to keep the league going. It's a professional league. They have to pay everybody. And the money comes from ticket sales and that sort of thing. The WNBA would not exist if the NBA didn't subsidize the league, right? The NBA pays for the WNBA to exist. So it's a lot of talk about the number one draft pick for the WNBA only got paid X amount of money versus the number one draft pick for the NBA gets paid this amount of money. And the difference is tens of millions of hundreds of millions of dollars and a lot of women are up in arms and they're like this is going on because of the wage gap and women earn less and all that stuff okay that may hold water in some arguments in some sectors but it doesn't hold any weight at all with what we're talking about people don't support the WNBA and like Bill Burr says women don't support the women National Basketball Association that's it so women are upset because women don't even support the WNBA and they're making all these narratives up and they're trying to tell partial truths and make this argument if you want the women of the WNBA to make more money they need to be supported so ladies if you're out there and you're mad because the WNBA women aren't getting paid like the NBA, what you need to do is buy tickets. You ain't even got to go to the game. Just right now, pull out your phone or if you're sitting in front of your computer right now, type in WNBA. When all the teams come up, pick a team. If you got a team in your hometown, great. If you don't, pick a team and buy some tickets. Right? If you're someone like Whoopi Goldberg on The View who had a lot to say about this. I got a lot of respect for Whoopi. She's a legend in the comedy business. You know what I mean? She's a great actor. I give her her due, but she got this all wrong. Whoopi, and all you wealthy women out there, if you want to help the WNBA, buy season tickets. Better yet, how about buy out a whole booth right up there where the, you know, where the big money sits. Buy out a booth for a whole season. Pick your team. And, and just send in that money. You know, and give it away if you want to. See if you can get people to go to the game. But buy the tickets. Buy the season tickets, the individual tickets. You know what I mean? Rent out the booth up there. The VIP suites, those big suites. Rent out the suite for the whole season. And just send your people, send your friends of your show, The View. Send giveaway tickets in that city to that suite the bottom line is you got to financially support the league the WNBA cannot exist on its own 25 years plus and they haven't turned a profit why no one's watching half the population I believe are made up of women if every woman were to buy some WNBA merchandise and buy a ticket that league would be doing great numbers watch the Bill Burr comedy special live at Red Rocks when he talks about the WNBA, he's spot on. It has nothing to do with gender. It's all business. So I just wanted to throw my two cents out there. If you don't agree with me, or if you do agree with me, let me know in the comments below. I'm going to talk to y'all later. I'm DL Saint. Peace.